Is there a time to pick it up? It would be now, Furia. Setting themselves up now. A big clash about to occur. It's Nozzle who's gonna have to hold this one off. Dark. Dash as well, forwards into the smoke here. Digicine, he's weakened, yet still takes the fight. Lucky not to go down as well. There was a bit of a spray through with the Frenzy. Shy, again falling so damn low, but the rest of his team now reinforcing themselves. Fury are running Leviathan's attack pistol round against them. <laughs> That's quite interesting. And they start to power through now. What can they make do with? Fragment Nade over the top. It's going to be clearing out the bottom of it. Dash to the side with the Paranoia. There's a turret in their face. That was another team paranoia. Players, yeah, team paranoia blinding all of them. A bit of miscommunication potentially. King is out of the open. Nowhere to hide. Nowhere to stand. Fury taking the opening. But he makes sure that the rest of Fury cannot follow up on Dijazine. That's a nice adaptation. It shows you that Shy is extremely aware of Dijazine's normal pathing, and this is unusual from Azino. They do not normally have this level of aggression on their defense side. Some might say it's inadvisable when you're at such an eco advantage. Oh, and a deep pushed up position. But this is definitely throwing a different look into things. Oh, why are you anticipating it? Maybe hearing a sound cue or sing of the likes. The cleanup. It's easy, isn't it? Clearly the last one standing. The bonus round of Fury. Cover going All but secured now for Lev. It'll have to be huge. It's not going to be. Flawless Good. keeping all the guns. Good halt to the momentum there. There isn't really potentially that committal into B main. They haven't forced out King's Cover nade. King is holding nade here, waiting for cat pressure. As soon as he hears the smoke go off. And he's re-pop well. with a flash after breaking this drone. Here we go, drone in his face though, suppressed. Neutral to be used, the angle to the side of the smoke, Taco. 30 seconds no left. No blind fire. It's set up to try and support the rest of his team so they can't be pushed onto that angle. Let's give it a hot drop up, King. And this angle with three kills. Absolutely ludicrous. Khalil though still alive and maybe return to the beginning of the season. That form that he looked like, but he's got so much more to do on top of that. One versus three, shot guys bringing him low. There it is, it'll finish him off. Flat money in the back pocket. But a round win for Lev. What a performance from King. There's never been any question all year and before that as well in 2020. Really sell this. Off angle position. Cleared. And a slightly. Only the one for one though traded. Not going to be favorable actually. Now all that kills our utility. It was otherwise going to be delaying this. It's taken out or removed. Under's Fury now forced through. That's NW just trying to make the most of it with the ultimate. Clearing some pathways into the back of the side, but avoid and dodge for now. And Oswa. It's up to him, anchoring to the ward, Zid, Taco, supporting him. Going wide here with the shots, onto it, still onto lane. And W, and Khalil, alive in the fight. Low on HP, Khalil, a single shot, we're doing a trick, down. Narrowly, dodging, avoiding. This way, that way, spikes drop down, 35 seconds remaining, and tap down, and W. Clutch. That is ludicrous. <gasps> Some down to just a coin flip, but King so aware. Of all the presence, shocked out in the back though with the prior damage done. Shy, he's weakened and they're barreling over. Nozwa is the last line of defense ready to try and anger this one, but they want to try and flood in. Taco is eager to take a fight, he's shut down in the process of it. Not able to get anything going. Every angle watched for, every moment covered, and that's Fury with minor investments around their guns. Like this is a prime setup, isn't it? Yeah, Getting so this ahead. is the cannon dart that's designed to put pressure on people close, oh, yeah. like King. It's forced out, at least that no command, but already look at that cap being exploited towards. But MW lost into... his ult. Grass and tree, yeah, MW did lose his ult in the process. The drone doesn't clear it again. Not no again. way, no, so you gotta clear that. Corner not being watched for. And all the positioning. King, he's gonna try and hold it down, but he's corralled. Scurrying into the corner, 45 health, Nana Swarm, they know where he is, it's watched with the rifles. One shot to the chest, enough to bring him down. Spike planted. A 4v2 with Taco on the flank. And at this point, Lev, they have to commit. It's round 11. Two more chances. You have to try and pull this one off. No one watching that one. Dice was open for a second. The reposition though, they want to hide from Taco's operator. Furia are leaving gaps. And maybe you're starting to see it. The explosiveness that we witnessed earlier on in the season. A team like Lev, but MW shuts it down. Can Taco still make the most of it? Set them up, shot to the side, needs a rifle though. Better gun for the job, Spike not planted for him. Right to the side, it's the Jazina, dice. Yo, did spray, the util, it's sent flying. Dars lining up every single player. Digizine moving down to the side. No way! 
Adjustments are made and two kills collected. Cracked open towards the back of the site. Just needs his team to get in there and get the spike planted. And the post plant positioning. It's not ideal. They don't have any B main control. But the player advantage should sail them through this. Again, Shai and Noz were utterly bullied. And the rest of Leviathan left to try and pick up the pieces. Spam in the common positions. It's a 3v5. Got to try and put in some work. Paranoia, it's cut its way across. Angles, watch. Last player standing is King. Dart lights him up. Spam damage from every single line of sight. That's eight to four. And Furia. My God. They've done their homework. B main, just disrespecting. Shy the dash across the cut across. Watch four. Spam onto it. King falls early. He's been the guiding light for his team. And with him removed, how will this round be switched up? How will it change? Flank's got to be watched. Onto the side. Did team just holds it? Shy a wider swing. Looking like he wanted to try and take the fight to them. And that's exactly what Taka was thinking. Pushing into his own smoke, but he's just being peppered with bullets. Weakened this way, that way. Flashed up to the side once more. The crossfires, the retakes. It's too good. It's sublime. Four players left standing. And this looks like it's going to be a very quick map one. They quite know what they're up to, but King, the IGL, playing over in A main, is telling his team to come and meet them. This one's for the A site. What do they have to clear? Cover to a tree. Not Doesn't much, but that's up. fine because there's no one there. Yeah, Paranoia's there. Time running short though, 12 seconds into the round. Still Moving forward, Paranoia. Buys a bit extra, space gain still alive. Still in the fight, still kicking! Oh. Flick to the side. Mazzino, gonna regret taking that one. Still, Spike is planted. We do have some of the guns, but this is gonna be the retake into it. Fury looked good in this capacity. Door needs to be broken. Knives on knives. What's the call to be made? They're waiting for Mazine. Look at him in Gelato right now. Coming to take a main control. Yeah, that's going to be the cue. Dart there. Shot lands though. To Mazine. On a quick scope. Pure prediction. Shy onto the angle he's brought down. Crumbling to his knees. Furia. Oh, looking just monstrous. Updraft dash. Already making his way all the way through. Backside of Jenny Khalil. He's here. He's holding for the swing from Switch. And Taco gambles incorrectly. The shorty was pulled out. He thought it was going to be a close corner angle that was watched for. The fight's being taken on every area of the map. Respect being showcased. The Khalil. king prevails. Yeah. Wins his one out. So four on four. Oh, 3v3. Spikes planted. Lockdown available. This is where out the site. Alt. Under Fury, that's going to be taking that one out of Fury and not wasting their time, their chance, their opportunity, and they know where Nozra is. Alton from main is lit up. The Nana Swarm, he cannot swing, he cannot fight, he cannot push them back. Fury has set themselves up to map point. There's an alarm bot here, and Dejazine's playing in front of it. Oh, and it's just fallen to pieces. Let's make the call here. Exploration everywhere. Risks, of course, taken. Trying to make the most of it. Trying to hunt for anything to equalize, but at this point, every player being whittled away. King and Nozwa left standing. 12 to 5 on the brink. Last one left. That's just King, but it's just done. Spam out to the corner. Confidence is boundless. And Furia strolling away. A jaunt in the park is what map one feels like. They take it. That shows you they had a really good game plan there for Ascent. The map Vita works perfectly for them. They tackle something that, while it was a strength in the past for Leviathan, has just looked like more and more and more of a weakness. This is common. They'd like to do this. Snake bite around the back. That's going to set them up with the flash. Everybody getting brutalized. But the damage and the bullets, it's exchanged. It's even to a degree. But still, it's Furia with the two-player advantage. Shy on the close corner. The spike planted. The watch for damage done, Khalil. He lands it. Into the back of Horse and his fight does take it. It's held. The crossfire is there. Salvage saved. QCK is putting in so much work. Towards the back with the Guardian. Flashing his face. Can't see a thing. Let's lose the clip. But three in a round. King's there. And there's so much patience and so much confidence there. Way in front of that, getting really good information for his team. The, the player at risk, to be honest, is Taco. He's on such a close angle with this op. 
Off angle though, on top of the box. Don't really hard clear that one. So, opens it up, but no time wasted. Running all the way through. Taco with the reposition, oh, Mr. Shot. Left. But King's got a fantastic spot here. Yeah, smoke at his feet. They are cut on. They have to make the call here. Today, main could be compromised. Look at them. They're jiggling it, baiting it. The they know it's there. Cove. Gets them onto the site. Plan. Gonna be stuck. Pushing forwards. QCK. It's spam down. And the fights are being won out just Fight like that. A. Not enough time to spare Ten now. Seconds Ten left. seconds. Down to nothing. Khalil with plenty of money. Would love to do some more economical damage, but... Chooses not to take the fight to them. And all the way at the back of the horse, it's anyone's game. With this many walls in their face, the smoke's there on top of it. Trailblazer are broken. Round to the side, Taco. He wants to get a fight, a clean one, but he's not going to be handed it. It's never easy. Spike planted. Still control towards the back of the horse here. Yes, Shy was handed again another opportunity. Could not find it, could not get the kill. And with the Vipers bit down now, it gets that much more difficult. Off angle. MW. High tide, reactions there, retreats back to the pit. Defensive position flashed up, aims for the reaction, snake by clears him, this is good Utah from Lev. But you still have to wade through all of this. The murky unknowns, the green on your screen. Oh, 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 jumping with the shorty, Mazid to do the most! Similar beginning, high tide now. Cuts up into half of it, playing inside the smoke. Taco, good movement. Not enough to adjust, though. It's the Jazeem. And look at that. Pushing all the way through. Tried to time it up with the dog. It is returned and traded. Seekers now getting a bit scrappy. It's anarchy. But already, QCK and Khalil have taken their timings through B-Link. They recognize that Leviathan were getting the better end of it, and they've already given Mazine more options as the IGL. Yeah, Tara broken now, Shy. Who's forwards anyway? Wants to take the fight to them, but still alive. What's the back? He knows he's being pressured. Regain control bot. of falls. Now there is an opportunity, a chance to slow this down. 50 seconds into the round. All falling. Oh, that B-Link flash yeah. gives them bad information. They think Khalil's disappeared. And that gives the right timing now for Fury. Moving forward to the high tide. And the Swarm's not broken, though. Already on to the side. Shai has to push up inside of his own. Got his teammates One to back him, though. Kobe's there. Kills found. Before it can materialize. Footsteps, both teams oh, waiting for the right time here. Possibly util to come back on with the flash is there. Snake bite into the corner, clearing the corners. They want to take the fight straight up! Just to get up one after the other, but the crossfire is down. Shy looked like sleeping in a wheel for but a moment. Khalil still alive! Close onto the corner, but okay, Taco aware of it. Now a lockdown can be used in kind. That's gonna clear through into the back of halls. This flank attempt by QCK might be pivotal. We'll keep an eye on it. Round stand of aggress. Backing out. Any sort of detainment? Not quite. Straight up playing the retake. But there's no high time. There's no harbor utility. Yeah, not gonna have that extra wall to push them away. You have to take the fights to them. Shot misses. Taco's low. Smoke to cover his teammates back. QCK. He's gonna be the difference maker. He's with every shot. And Shine's just stuck in the way. Take it out. Destroyed. Have on it. Shots this way. That way. Nils was sticking that up. Time. Yes. Barely done. And the util to take that A main control. He's done a lot. Okay. Instantaneous QCK. He's always there. Ready for the swing. Ready for the trade. Not lacking the confidence. And King was trying to pop his Vipers all based off pressure from Furia. He was playing a really aggressive spot. But now they're in a 3v4. And he's used his pit on the opposite side of the map. He's just going to be anchored to that position, tethered there. Miles away from the action. Ball's being made though. He's already leaving it, already abandoning it. They can hear it barreling their way down. Be long. Robles are clearing the close corners. A bit of spam on top of it, but they still have to get through this Nana Swarm setup. This is Shy. Pop this off now. Lamot taking that contact. Still, the Jazine all the way into the back of the horse. The reckoning clearing through. No time wasted. Oswald, look at this from him. Wants to take the battle to them. Two kills, traded out though. Still, need to get the spike down. Mazine is dead. Not enough bullets left. All because of that. One misstep. Flash is going to confirm their suspicions. They're going to be granted towards them up through Link. But Sight is anchored. It's locked down. Dash. Forwards are cut it up inside the smoke. Mazine wants to take the fight to him. Back and forth, back and forth. The right clicks. It's there. Maybe Taco's done enough. Set them out for it. Mazin, there! Oh, wall falling. Inopportune. Shy capitalizes, lands the shot for him. Up to Khalil now.
as the armor has the frenzy. Maybe it will be a bit of a raid boss moment, but he's got so much to clear. There's a crossfire set up. King holding just close to it, spots it out. And a wide swing. But and they often will. Oh, here in we an go. MW, here they start. Might be setting up for it, aren't they? And no utopian use, just contacting up, Taco! Look at this way, that way, 360, all sorts of directions. Didn't know Blinded. what to be watching for. And Down still, away. it's a contact play. Lever just trying to work their way into this one without making too much noise, but being met with the rifles to beam them down. down. Two players eight. left. Spike dropped left. down in the middle of nowhere. 30 seconds. Suddenly getting less and less to work with. Would have to be massive. You can pick up a rifle upgrade, though. Shy's going to take that Vandal for a bit more. Nana Swarm. It's a good read. Yeah, into the corner. Dead at that one spot. Oh, my. Oh. UCK looking towards B, looking to set themselves up for the B split. Stun. The connection, no follow up. Instead, Shy works himself in a different direction and it's still being watched for. So, oh no. With, with Shy falling, the alarm bot goes down. Tushasim was already pushed up in A, but now he gets the opportunity to flank. All the way around, there's a fight to be taken in art. It's King that wins it, but he doesn't expect this, surely. No, Poison's not a clue. Gone. That's got to accelerate things. Place. Yeah, you have to start playing now with it of pace. Oh, Updraft up onto the corner. Smoke. Fade dropped down. Tackle with his back to it. Does not expect Khalil to be holding. Another One flash. Down. It's beautiful with the connection. Mazzino attempted to swing through onto the code playing anti. Looking to see if he's going to get pushed once more. Power dropped. There's contact. Dog's broken early on. Oh, Shiny's to win the fight. Dash still there. Seekers. Full committal. It's only the one for one. With the Spectre in his hands. Not what. It's not set up for it. It's a squeeze. Taco He's all the way through main. And they were none the wiser. But quick reactions from MW. He will shut that down. Now the Seekers. Spike planted. Bowling the way forwards. Trying to clear the way up onto the high ground. Pop flash. Ah, okay. Not so he dodges it. It's a full util dump, but it is all over the place. What a sky outplay. That's oh ridiculous. My. This way, that way, on top of the Should, Do you bite on this if there's no sky? The reckoning as well. The big committal with the ultimates is exchanged and a chance to fight back. Furia flashing through into it. Again, the dodging of the movement machine. He's too clean with it. A wider swing, a wider face for Taco. He does put a stopper to it and still. Spike planted. The plan does go down. Still though, making sure they don't step themselves deeper in towards the back of the site. So still holding towards Secret and Flowers. The positioning is madness once more. Reflank. QCK. He wins it out, even with the Guardian. Two shots is all it takes. Picks up the upgrade. And now running all the way back into the sideline. Those were the dodging of the move, but enough with the shots. Tap, tap with a rifle. And the double play set up. Both players towards R. They're just taking a first contact onto the corner. They don't know where King is. Expected to be towards main. Sticking all the way. This is not half all the way. Not quite clear. He's taken out. Snake bites, pushing him back. This is in needle and the shot king. No operator. That's found in mid. He's need to take the contact here. It's a fight to be taken. Alt's expended on either side. Crouch shy on the angle, and he's got his team to back him up. King and Shy have been doing the most. All that containment towards mid, not just against the weaker buys, but now the guns as well. Furium, I just have to go for a, a save here. It's hard on the defense side, to be honest, because you don't know where Leviathan are going to end up. But if Lev end up getting into a plant situation, it could end up being rough for them. The benefit that Furia have is that the B site is still locked off with this Viper's Pit. But playing 1-1-1 one, one, one around the map leaves a ton of openings ton of for openings. Lev to barrel through. It is a little bit risky. I mean, here. you need to save your guns if you're Furia. Got your you don't have the money to keep throwing them away. It's rounds like this, but maybe they feel like they just can't. The Seekers pushing back. They know that one player is isolated there on towards the back of the side. It's Khalil still with the setup. Are right, going to be left. spotting this one, MW. All about the timing on this one. Swings wide, takes the fight. All the way to them, not one. Still alive and kicking. King. How are they going to be able to block this one off? Who is favored? And that's what it comes down to. Left. There's an angle here, MW. Can he do the most? There's a head to be found, but he's taking all sorts of damage. Spike to be planted, sprayed by Khalil. Brought down to their knees, an attempt by Nozwa. But even he Spike is denied and shy. Last one standing. Forced to take a back seat. 20 seconds left, no chance in hell of him winning this one. And so Furia 
Get the chances of staying in map two alive and kicking. Ten seconds left. And what a way in which to do it. After so Time many straight point. rounds in a row Using from Leviathan, Fans to tap onto it, forces the first layer of Util out. You gotta play up, you gotta take the fight right past this one. Movement dodging Duking to the side, Mazina will be the first to fall. And still they take the battle towards them, but nobody is sticking the spike. It's coming down to critical seconds. And at this juncture, who will reign supreme? Who will land the shots? Sticking through on the gold, Furia, they survive! Call is made though for Furia. Dash forwards, high tide as well, splits up this side. Now Shy still gonna be sitting towards the back. Dog broken, spam as well. Will they be blessed with a kill? Just trying to force out that util. It's a tap of the spike. Sitting in the snake bite though, sticking this one here. Single bullet would do it to him. The turret still not broken. It brings him down. Never been granted. A massive chance. Swarming themselves onto the site. All the smokes blocking them off. The high tide, every single angle. And it's down to the Util again. But it's a 3v5. And as long as it's watched for with the code placed up, down to MW. He sprays it down, he sprays it through. He gains the one, but not enough done. These shots. The exec comes through. Nana Swarm blocking off the common position. Plant from Mazzino. Stuck, but it's covered. The right angle's there. And you can feel it now. The tension, the pressure is on. Khalil. On the top side angle, no one was watching that. And Tiger will fall. He's sort of repositioned. He's going to be calling that out to his team, but it's a 3v4. This is seen. He's got the art. Art fight one. And now squeezing onto Mazzino, taking the right timings with it. Have to win this fight. They do. Down to kick again. Snake bite. Launched at the feet. He knows no one's sticking it. It collides. Weak enough. One kill foul. Doesn't last the second. Khalil. He saves it. He's alone. No one's really helping fight off of this one. Does he get cleared though? I don't expect it. Here, yeah. now repositions with the updraft. There was Util being used to push him back. Now the high tide as well towards Art. Fight being met pound for pound. It comes down to how these jewels get one out. And already holding towards main, smoked off. Sticking it down onto the defuse. Khalil, would it be any spam? Any sort of presence? It's half of the defuse. Needs to hit the shots. The recess, they're a shy. On the high ground position. The one try and deny yet again another chance up draft onto the box common high ground angle spots the first player no fight to be won qck will he take the right timing shots rattled off back and forth close to the corner machine unbelievable and the reckoning built up let rip let loose and barreling forwards now no attempt to win the fight or no chance i should say it's 14 to 14 again furying it's coming down to it. The committal is there, contacting left. right into the sideline. It's a disengagement, Taco. He moves his way back, but someone needs to deal with this trailblazer. It's hunting him down, spots him out. The reposition again, taking up control of main. It's gonna be difficult for Fury to deal with. A deep flash once more, QCK timing here. Sticking onto the plan, patience from King moving forward. It's a shorty, denies the plan. And Lev, they set themselves up. Time and time again is what it feels like. Pumping bullets, the utility all the way through into the side king. Just hoping for a chance to rip someone's head off. Oh, the counter spam. Wow. That's just Taco trying to remove whatever kills or utility. He can get going for it. Furia. Again. It just, it's two players advantaged. It feels like Furia thrive when their backs are against the wall. This team has been incredible at 4v5 situations all season, and now they just can't lose when they're facing a map point. And left scramble, looking for answers. The deeper high tide. Flash, the dog is being blocked off. Good defensive utility to Cascade to at least help him out as well. Blocks off that one angle so they can't scale forwards as a shorty. Mazzino's hands, but the spike needs to be planted. He's got it in his hands. Jumpy around the side. Damage left. done. But still no space gained. Still no space granted. Spam. Bullets raining down on them. Lev not handed. An easy chance to try and get the spike down into the post plan. They wade right into it. Khalil with the crosshair placement. Running this way, remaining. that way. Drop down. No chance in hell for Mazzino. Out to the side, wins his fight, but he's got to get this spike down and tap onto it, and he knows it's just too hard. Furia, 15-15, Josh, it's never ending.
Back into the action. There's a snake bite. Dropped down so nobody can push past this point. And still being held up with the two players. Watching for it. Otako is crouched. And he just needs an inch. He'll take a mile. Still QCK might be the next line of defense. Pushing back all the way through. Mazzino groups his way around. And he might have just saved them. It was a 2v3, left down to it with the Cove. He can stick it half all the way. Just needs to watch the angle shot. Oh! Oh! I mean, this is crazy. Moments like this in OT. Sometimes the unorthodox play is the best left. one. Lev, they realize now the site's opened up. They reposition, taking our control. But it's this fight that's to be taken. Noswa watching it crouch down. Not favored, or at least he should have been. He doesn't win the fight. Doubled up. It's a bait and switch. Running the footsteps away to Jazeen. He holds his ground now. And the whole goal of this one is to retake and re-clear through into Art. Another push up position. It's Taco behind the box. MW low. The flash gets negative info. He takes his timing. And it's just immaculate. Striking forwards to Jazeen though. Still 2v2. Men is match. Make it one. Khalil. So much more. The jump spot towards it. And Lev. In the moment of need here, toying with them. They know time's low. They know it's running out. Jumping round, it's Taco with four. 16-16. Oh, Taco's alone. The flash connects. Moving forwards. Dash is dead. Doesn't hit the flick. Brought down. Dudazin finds the opening. The reposition all the way to screens. Dashed up top. Is it going to get cleared? The spam all the way. It's down to this on the corner. No way. Not a chance. Mazzino does not go unnoticed. And with him falling to 5v3, everything being thrown at the wall. Furia. And just pure pace. That's a decision that gets made. That's how they want to take the round, and that's how they are going to win it. It's up to Noswa to do the impossible. In a 1v4, with all the utils in the night and delay, it just wasn't going to happen. I would claim that 2 0. Anything but easy. Moving into mid. Risks on risk. And with the util out. None the wiser. Pushing forward. He's stunned up. The fire is returned. They're skipping a hop up the staircase. But Lev, they got once more. In a 3v2. The spike is planted. They've got the post plant set up. I said Leviathan looked like they were out of gas, but that one was pacey, creative. Loved it. Still winnable though for Furia. Yeah. See magic from Khalil and Dejazine. Dejazine, he found that rifle close towards the box, a position that's been played before. He's been seen, he's past the rifle. It's equalized down to that two on two. Who finds a one? And is it down to this? Mazzino versus Khalil. Turn spot six, shot lands. 17. It's a triple face. They're putting so much in secret. And they could just walk straight into this. Flash, dodge, a second one used once more. Lined up. And the rifles, they sing. An exchange of bullets. It's a reckoning online. It moves its way across. It's traded. Two players left standing. Machine. He repositions and he collects Taco. Last one left. Stun. Still meets him. Shot to be found here. But with one bullet left, it's just not good enough. Round of OT, or will it be Furia running away with it? Fight to be taken, and it's matched. There's a trade, but it's a scramble and an evacuation away from Art. They want nothing to do with it, Lev. They slow it down. They have a minute on the clock. That is really good from Mazzino. Yeah, good head, destroyed. good head space to be able to break that Trailblazer too. He has the spike. If he committed to trying to get the trade, that would have been even oh, more yes. disastrous. This Killjoy utility is very rarely getting broken. No one wants to land towards B at no. all. It's all been going towards A. I mean, part of the reason is that you rely so much on ultimates actually pushing people away from B. But look at this, Furia. They've made the read. They're gambling. Gambling. The match win on the fact that this ends B. There is only QCK left. defending the A site. And they are wrong. Back to the sides. UCK, maybe a bit of spray, could do some work here. He's got the angle, oh, but he's no! met instantly. What a read from King. Ten seconds Rips left. his head clean off. And the spike is planted, repositions. No one playing in art, everybody from main, and they've got the util to delay. What a difference in terms of post-plant positioning. None of that aggression that we saw from Furia. Cascade through. The first layers of this now being used as a snake bite overlapping with the Nana Swarm. Nobody's tapping this yet. 
Two big pieces being used very early on my left. Here's the snake bite. The Jazim. Working himself up. Operator. Looking for the easy shot. He will not be grounded in. And it's an absolute bloodbath. A brawl. Left up to Khalil. And it's comical, isn't it? With the pressure mounting. 18 18. Operator. Taco. Close. Oh, my. What a read. It's that instinct. He heard the footsteps. He knew they'd be barreling in that direction. And he brings the Jazine down. That jet head to head. Trailblazer, stun connects. Close to the default box, MW. He's got to be careful not to be sprayed down. But he's safe for now. Moving forwards into the B split. So high tide rips his way across the plan. Wall start to go down. Mazine gets it off cleanly. Moves back away. These are very four positions that are being held by the M... I mean, only by MW, though, right? He's kind of on an island away from the rest of the squad. The player advantage, maybe that's why he's looking for a pick to try and at least get them that advantage. But Taco watches. The swing towards Pillar brings Whoa. him down once more. High tide. It's interesting. Cuts his way through onto the side as a snake bite as well. Surely he doesn't come down to this. Surely he doesn't come down to spam. Nana Swarm's there, fights to be taken, you've got to push up if you are, love the spray! It's not planning for them, round to the side, they got to swing wide, left, they stick it through! Taco contains! Nobody in positions to spam and stop the cold from going down and Mazzino planting. Oh, the turret being used, that's heard by Khalil, and they're starting to trickle back over to B. Moving up. Reinforcements starting to arrive. Nana Swarm setup still there. It's unusual though. The way it cuts its way across. Nobody can play close to it. There's an opportunity to punish! And they do just that. Taco was alone. His team couldn't push up. They couldn't play with him. Cove now lay it down. Plant has to be found. QCK opens himself. And he's brought down as well. It's the Warbind kill. It's a three versus four. And Lev. Right here, right now. A chance. They need to grasp it. It's there for them. Wall in their face, smoke, obfuscating, hiding, and the kills flowing one after another. Pushing forwards, no one's sticking it. Everything to play for. Digizine will not be able to do it. Left, pull it off. Ten. Twenty rounds gained for Lev. What? Punishment? In play. Double satchel movement is clean enough. But that's the stim. Yeah, Stimmy as well, the extra speed boost all the way. And now we see a Trailblazer. Reclearance now into showers. Broken, just in time still. A timing to be taken with Mizzino. Slipping past right the smoke, down, making okay. sure that he can try and do some damage and take these fights into the back a bit. This way, that way, 48 health, low enough that a Warbang might do it. Dodging Juke, no way! Throwing it all quickly, but not as quickly as MW takes this space. Nade for a nade, wider. There's a swing taken. Wow. Nozzle with two. Spectre. Great start to try and convert the bonus. He's got his nade back on. What the? And this is a disastrous beginning for Furia. A team that very easily could have 2 0 this match so far and be sailing on for that Brazilian rivalry match. And it could have been done. It was looking like it was potentially one of the faster series that we've seen, but. Blue. They fought all the way back. Brought us to map number three, and now a great beginning, although letting slip a little bit there. Information going not quite their way. It's a contact play from Khalil. He's worked his way up onto the side. Down. Doesn't know if showers is clear, though. You can see the hesitancy. Lays down the molly, though. Should grant him a free plan. And I say should. One enemy but it is being converged on. Up to the Jazine now. Last one left. Let's have the plant down. Got that going for him. They don't know where he is. He repositions. Isolates one of the fights. Smoke. Drop down. Use the cross. Away. Now tap onto the spike to try and bait it. Dijazine, he's playing this quite nicely. Looking to hunt for the kill. Looking to hunt for the fight. But Taco watches his teammates back. And so the bonus round is there. And yeah. <laughs> Alternation there on the control key. Okay, Careful. Okay, okay. Taco. <laughs> to be taken, oh, shy. Posted back up now onto this one, but he's in danger of being running gunned. There's what a play and attempt. Yeah, a very wide swing. It offsets the aim enough that he gets a backer for the rest of his team. Reckoning. Mazine close inside the smoke. Takes the fight and the battle right to King. Here and now to Mazine. Amazing with a reset. The precision is there. 
He's landing kill after kill, and it's left just up to two. There's a res in the back pocket, along with a showstopper. But the position is known and noted and taken care of. Furia have got a complete lockdown on this entire site. Enough money in the back pocket for Taco to make a go of it. Gets the first, but time going to be his worst enemy. And he spots MW, knows that the round is over at this point. A great response from Furia there. Just as we're talking about the potential for mental capitulation, they respond back with that. Showstopper's going to be used on both sides. Will he be handed it? Right down at the feet, Mazzino. Didn't stand a chance. Full damage, but an instant res, and now there needs to be a defense of the body. Nade cuts close to the back of Lamps. 27 seconds left. The spike needs to be planted here. Clill low enough that... Can't walk into that snake bite. Pushes him away. Here's the second one to it. Wow, back these, and forth, these back are and coming forth. from B breath. All the way from across the map. It's like combined pressure that's being applied. Now the plan can start to be sticked up. The push attempt. A fight to be taken is traded. All the way around. The Gizini holds it. The ground. No one able to fight them towards showers now. And he backs away. Dropping the smoke down on top of it. Noswa. Jump spots. Knows Khalil's position. Doesn't know where he could have gotten up to. It's a two versus three. The players are weak enough. It's winnable for Lev. If Noswa gets they choose this to play kill, together. if Noswa gets the kill, he has Nade. Yeah, kill found. Noswa does get it. Nade online, but 60 health to it. Bounds it off, right back to the side. It's a south Wait, flash. The into the Nade. Oh, no, oh, no. Oh, the left. It bounced just into the wrong section. And it could have been a difference maker, but nevertheless, it's being held though the it angle is. that he could peak it's being held as long as king doesn't overflank oh my god there's no way and that's just a game of chance i can't believe that and neither side is really certain of where players could be lurking cut its way across lurks on lurks mazino he's going to be gifted a freebie there it is and potentially the open up the rest of his team flooding into the back of the site. Mazine. Well done to get the two. QCK takes his timing, takes his look. Tap, tap, tap goes the rifles. And Furia find a footing in that one. It's going to look. Ball broken. Sprayed. Hunts him for the all. Not with the showstopper. Wants to take the fight. It clips against something. Doesn't get the kill. Damage done, though. With Mazine falling. Meanwhile, pressure down short. Mazzino knows, as does Nosworth. They re-clear this spot. Caution here. Oh, the wall drops! Just at the wrong time for that. Dash now activated. What a kill and what a shot. Locks it off. Will he clear the corner? The answer is yes, yet Mazzino still lands the shot. Reckoning. Thinks he's being punished. Tackle's still in showers. It's crumbling. It's falling. Furia. I've got a grasp at anything they can. Wrists need to be there. The dog misses to the side. Clear, narrowly dodging it. But it's a two versus three. Speaking of risks, look at where QCK is. A tap onto the spike, looking. See if they can force and isolate a fight. Shy is aware of this. <sighs> the they Furia players are never afraid to make plays like this. 30 when they're seconds down. left. Yep. Oh no! Absolutely oh, incredible with the timing! And it's left world. into a 2v1. And this is how they win. Play a disadvantage situation so often because they're not afraid to gamble. Into the corner, King's there with the judge oh. vulnerable up. The shorty. It looks like they are. QCK's grouping up. Is this left. to hit the TP or hit the site? War was fading. I think that's the timing they're waiting for. They don't make any noise. They contact. But they're going to be wading into the stack all the way, Taco. First one to go down towards the back of the site. It's all up to King. And it's too much for him. The IGL, the leader. He can't put the push down. Ten seconds left. Mazzino, last one left. It's round 12. Final chance. You've got to put everything into it. Cove gets him into the site. But not for much longer. No more steps to be taken. A lot of their sage utility. Like something slow and cautious. Oh, here we go. Oh, smoke wow. drops down. It gives him the timing. The all face. Well, that was different. Yeah. Bit of a core made. And off the back of that, Wall cuts his way through. It's a TP, an attempt to crunch. And it clears all the way through into showers. They now know. Nobody really waiting around there. But time has been bought for but a moment. Now the nade rebounds. So again, not a clean plan. It's yeah. actually missing. Yeah, bad nade, actually. But it still forces Taco off the plant and breaks a section of the wall. 
He's attempting to try and get this down so they can get put into the forest plant. Wall needs to be broken. Brutal piece of utility to chew through when you've only got pistols. They do break a portion of it. Now in lamps, there's an important fight. QCK close to the angle. Right click. Why not? That'll do it. Stops around the gun. Drops and changes. Fury now looking to try and retake into this, but they're all so damn low. Pushing forward. The frenzy. Nosra did not intend to get that, but he's eventually brought down. Gives him that angle. But already, it's King who's worked his way past it, creeping and crawling. King is so deep, but he's not being offered anything just yet. And he's out in the middle of no man's land. Wide. Oh, wants to take the fight to them. It's MW. Instantly responds. Sprays it down with the bulldog. And Shy falls on top of it. Fury. Looking like a grand entry now into the second half of Bind. Two players left standing. It's Mazino and Noswa. Showstopper. It's meant to be that extra element to try and set them up here. And it just cuts across that crosshair placement. They all drop just like that. Okay. The 10 to 5. All things considered, it should be set up for 11 to 5. Another satchel. Oh my goodness, it resorts to this. The running gun. Bit of running fun. Certainly is for Shy. Wins that one. Cascade in the face of Mazine. Popped up. Good angles to take there. Together, Lev. Good pushing. Yeah. Making sure that they were taking fights. Spike planted. Together with the spike down. And that post plan. And this response has been immediate. Back Up to the corner, standing. the rifle handed over to Taco. And the Jazine, no choice but to back away. So, said there needed to be something from Leviathan there. There certainly was. That one's so different to the way that Lev have approached the rest of their attack rounds. Just sending it into Hookah. Nosra and Shy working together. Oh, here we go. No! Oh, 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 no! This is the shot, get out of there! What's the save the operator? But he is being hunted close to the corner. Can't react to it. Can't hit the shot. Made into lamps. Flash around the corner. No connection. A wide swing. MW, gotta be careful. Almost satchel himself there into the TP. Holding on top of the bench. Furia. Oh my goodness. The way they're taking these fights, it's all together. It's perfect. Time was running short. All the pressure was applied to them. And yet somehow they come out on top. Fury not feeling knocked, are they? Despite I losing that map two in the fashion move. that they did. The Jazini's close. Disrespect shown. It's a reckoning at his feet. Updraft trying to evade capture from the opposition. Leotan already swarming onto the position. The flash is there by... Oh, my gosh! MW! Reactions! Precision! And Mazzino says, to hell with that. I'm pulling out the shorty. No quick gunplay and precision from him still. It's a two-on-two. Two. Shy gets the plant down. It's him in that post plant. Seekers spots it. Dijazine has to take the fight there. Shots on landing for Mazzino. Shy. He was too late the on the trade. He was too late and he's crouched up, waiting, seeing if somebody will grant him a free kill in a 1v2. And he doesn't know. Time was cut. So was sound. Waiting for any sort of chance, but it's just contact from Furia. Flash connects. Round to the side is dodged by Digizine, and the reactions are just amazing. And so many targets to choose from. He's punished a jump spot. Nos has been doing that all day long. MW holding his back, and it's a sheer crumble. The Vietnam laughing to gain everything to lose. Gliding to the side, to the molly, brought <laughs> down by his teammates. But it's a 1v3, and this map is all but over. In just a moment, Nosra with so much over the top clean movement. Stunned up, how does that connect? A tap onto it, enough noise made, he's evacuating, he's out of there. He's done it. He's actually slipped the net here. QCK overflanked towards short. Worried about what Nosra could do. I'm being stuck. Head on a swivel, doesn't know where anyone is, but a footstep made by Mazine, and maybe he could salvage it. Can he keep Lev in it? Surely not. Comes down to this fight. A furious discipline, a wide face! Doesn't reset it in time, he can't land the shot! And it's Furia! We'll be singing the praise of this team all day long. The adjustments were magnificent, and they've come into the playoffs.
here to stay. Furia secure their spot in that Brazilian rivalry. They take on Loud for a spot in Tokyo and a guaranteed spot at Champions later on in the year. That's what they've won, the right to challenge our number one seed.